It depends on the decisions you make with it, but it'll it'll be healthy. <laughs> okay. Welcome to Good yeah. Mythical More. Hey, I, I, I Eat your wood chips. I don't snacks. know how I didn't how I didn't think about that. But um, maybe it was the same rationale that went into well, us eating dog food. Well, but the funny thing is, is that I was 100% sure that it was dog food once you said dog food, and then I spit it out, and then, and now, then, and then in the last minute you were like, but I swallowed it, tastes pretty, and then I was like, maybe I'm just going crazy. <laughs> I thought it was completely psychosomatic just because you had said cat food. But no, it's obvious that it's for an animal. Psychosomatic. Okay. This is I, not a bad idea. Uh, I have cards here that have questions We're that smelling. we have not seen beforehand. Uh, these are prompts. These are these are descriptions of uh, strange celebrity diets. And I have a word bank here. We have more options than there are answers. We, we're going to be choosing from P. Diddy, Marilyn Monroe, Ashton Kutchner. <laughs> Kutcher is his name, but my mom calls him Kutchner. Uh, <laughs> Liza Minnelli, Clark Gable, Ryan Seacrest, Reese Witherspoon, Snooky. Snooky and Madonna. Madonna coming back again. Back at it again with the diets. All right, um, we're gonna work together as a team to see if we can clean sweep this thing. Clean it and sweep it. <clears throat> this celebrity chose the cookie diet to get in shape. The diet consists of eating up to nine 60 calorie cookies in timed intervals throughout the day to stave off cravings, or just to eat a lot of cookies and pretend it's a diet. <laughs> cookie diet. This feels like something that would have happened um, Back in the day, like a Marilyn Monroe, a Marilyn Monroe, maybe Eliza Minnelli in her younger days, uh, or not. P Diddy wouldn't do Liza this. Minnelli in like Arrested Ashton Development wouldn't days. do this. Clark Gable well, cookies. Are, yeah, he, he's not gonna eat cookies. Cookie rhymes with Snooky. Cookie Snooky is a candidate. Let's go with Liza Minnelli. But Liza Minnelli and Marilyn Monroe are better guesses. Liza Minnelli, really? She's a little. She's a little kooky. Let's go with Marilyn Monroe. Marilyn Monroe. She has some nice cookie curves, man. Marilyn Monroe. Now, are you telling us the answers as we go? I don't know. Yeah. Do you, you wanna? It's gonna make it easier as we go along, but there's more. Yeah. Okay, I'll tell you. It was Snooky. Ah! Snooky runs a cookie. Yeah, that sounds like a Snooky thing, she it does. She some cookie curves All right, too. let's sweep it from here. Sweep it from here. Although this celebrity is an adult, they are one among several who have adopted the baby food diet in which you have to exist on 14 servings of mushed up peas, carrots, and other baby food to drop pounds until you're at your goal infant weight. Infant weight. Uh, I mean, based on the taste of that, those peas from Demise, Demise peas. Um, I'm not into this diet, Ashton. Now, when we met Ashton Kutchner, he was he was on a um, juice diet. He's on a juice diet. He had all types of juices that he had made. Yeah, like he was on like some sort of a cayenne cleanse or something. Uh, I mean, he was very um, self-deprecating about it, and you he, know. he felt self-conscious about it. Uh, P Diddy wouldn't do this. Liza Minnelli again is a is a candidate for this. Baby, food. I also feel like Madonna. Or Reese Witherspoon would or have this capability. I could see Miss Witherspoon eating some baby food. She seems Reese Witherspoon seems too. It seems sophisticated like crazy. To do this. I, it's, yeah, it's a crazy idea. This is Liza Minnelli. Let's go with her or or Madonna. You choose between those two. Liza. It's Miss Witherspoon. Dang it! <laughs> We're so close. We get so close, and then we back off of the answer. Let's not do that again. Yeah. Boy, she was great in that Big Little Lies. She was great. I finished it last night. I started watching it, and I knew you were going to say you didn't like it. Uh, we don't have to. Talk I knew about you were going to judge me for it. I, no, t give me a reason to keep going. Does it get better? You didn't like it from the beginning. I didn't like episode one. It was kind of like I loved episode. It just one. seemed depressing. It's like I, I'm not interested in like hanging out with those people. I'm interested in watching them on television. I want to know who who died, though. Oh, I'll tell you. You want to tell you? Uh, not yet, because I'm going to try it for a second episode. Okay. One celebrity swears by the health benefits of eating raw onions every day, which reportedly improves immunity, regulates blood sugar, and reduces inflammation, and also reduces who will kiss you. Who would eat onions every day? Mm. Let's just keep going with... This is Clark Gable. This is like an old school. I eat an onion every day. This, I just... <laughs> I feel like this is Liza Minnelli again. 
I, well, she could be any of them. Let's go away from her. Remember, we're going with our first answer, which has always been you. You've been right, and I've changed it. So now I'm saying Clark Gable and asking you to trust me. Okay, Clark Gable. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, he ate onions every day. Also, I do think that's true. I think that there are a lot of health benefits to raw onions. I mean, it is true. Thing, I like an onion. Yeah, that's the first one that's like, okay. Mm. Yeah, the werewolf diet gets its name from requiring participants to follow moon cycles. Werewolf diet. This celebrity ran with wolves by eating normally for the most of the month, but going through a 24-hour juice cleanse on the new moon to receive its lunar energy. Now, we know that Ashton did the juice cleanse when we met him, but he, I don't did, he think didn't he talk about it like a werewolf. Yeah, he didn't. He wasn't talking about lunar energy. Lunar energy is a, is a certain type of person. This is a Madonna. Yeah. This is a Madonna or Eliza Minnelli. <clears throat> Could be P. Diddy. P. P. Diddy, Diddy doesn't care about moons. P. Diddy the, don't the, care about He doesn't the, care about the lunar cycle. What about the tides? He didn't care about the tides. Tides are a result of the moon. Do you got any lyrics about tides? He's a surfer. See P. Diddy on a longboard. Now, what we've done before is we've had an answer and then we What was your answer? I said uh, Madonna. Let's go with Madonna. It's Madonna. Yeah. (laughs) We're turning the corner. Hey, kids. Clean sweep. You're taking the SAT. Go with the first instinct. What is it now? The ACT? What do they take now? The fruitarian diet involves maintaining. They're thinking about it. Involves maintaining a diet, a daily dietary intake of at least 75% just fruit and landed this celebrity in the ER after one month of strict fruiting. This is Marilyn Monroe, man. You know mm. it is. You know, uh, Steve Jobs was a fruitarian for a while. Um, he's not on here, though. And he I think also Ryan, didn't go to the... Ryan Seacrest, mm, mm. he likes some fruit. Go with what you were saying. What were you saying? Marilyn Monroe? No. Steve Jobs. Oh, Ashton, Ashton Kutcher. Kutcher played <laughs> Steve Jobs. Ashton Kutcher. And he went method. Yep, so she, yep, Stevie yep. gave us the answer. Oh, Ashton Kutcher. So he 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 did it because yeah. of the role. Yeah. I oh, should, nice. Yeah, we right. understand the answer. there in the answer right in the face. And finally, up for grabs we have P Diddy, Ryan Seacrest, Liza Minnelli, and I think that's it. This famous person kept their figure by allegedly sticking to a strict diet of raw eggs in hot milk for breakfast, Ew. and then a hot fudge sundae at every night for a weird diet cherry on top. This is Marilyn Monroe all day long. You know she did this kind of thing. Raw eggs for hot, in hot milk? She, she, kept, she actually kept her figure. Yeah. Hot fudge sundae every night, yeah. Uh, Ryan Seacrest I don't think would never was, do this. He, Liza could have done it, and we wanted to say her in every time, but let's go, let's just go with Marilyn. Marilyn Monroe. You're right. For the win. Clean sweep. Once we started sweeping, you know, once you start cleaning up, you you just you keep, you mop up, yeah, baby. You keep mopping. Thanks for sticking around for Good Mythical More. If you want to watch more, well, we don't have Good Mythical More More, but we do have a lot more videos. Here's two of them. Also, click the circular channel icon to subscribe.